Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome to my channel, Ripex. And guys, here today in this video, I am going to show you how to fix the high CPU and the low GPU usage on your PC. Guys, there are a lot of reasons you are getting this issue on your PC. So in this video, I am going to guys show you how can you guys properly fix these issues on your PC if you want to get the better performance while you gaming on your PC. So guys, before starting out this video, if this is your first time here to my channel, so please subscribe, turn on the bell notification and smash the like button. So guys, without wasting any time, let's go straight into this video. So guys, first of all, what you need to do, just simply guys, download the CPU and the GPU optimization pack from my website. Link in the description of my this video. Just go there and download this pack. Guys, it is very simple. I show you a thousand times how to download this pack. So guys, just simply go and grab this pack. After downloading this pack, guys, open this folder. And guys, here is some folder. First is the CPU registry tweaks, the update driver, the power of CPU, disable Windows user things, and the command power plan. So guys, we are going to use these files for fixing out over these issues. And after that, I also show you guys how to do some window settings. Therefore, you can fix out uh, the high CPU usage and the low GPU usage while you're gaming on your PC. So guys, first here is the CPU user tweaks. So guys, open this folder. Here is guys some file. First here is the uh, CPU priority the port thread priority and the uh, priority class you need to just simply install these files on your pc right click here click on this merge button click yes and install this file on your pc again double click here and same guys install these files also on your pc do the same with the last file and guys after doing all of the settings now go back into the uh, boost pack now guys this is the most important settings which you need to do guys make sure to update your only driver this is the guys main reason you are getting the high CPU usage and the low GPU usage. So guys, how to do it? Just simply guys, uh, open this folder. Here is the software, the driver, booster setup. If you know guys how to manually install the driver uh, on your PC, so guys, you can also leave this. But guys, I 100% recommend you. Guys, this will also make your installation of your driver is uh, really easy. This will automatically install all of the driver on your PC. This is a software, guys. It is uh, completely free. You can also purchase it. But guys, I will not recommend you to guys uh, purchase this software. You can uh, still use the software and update your all the drivers. So guys, here is the interface. Just simply, guys, you can check it out here. The install iTop screen recorder. So guys, uncheck it because this is the advertisement. So guys, uncheck this box. Then click on the install button. This again, ask you for installing the Opera. So guys, click no thanks. And uh, now click on this next button again, and this will uh, start the uh, installation of the software on your PC. So guys, once the installation is complete, so guys, click here onto the no thanks and click onto the uh, scan now button. This will open this website. So guys, simply uh, minimize your browser and this is the interface of uh, the driver booster. So guys, it will automatically uh, start the scanning uh, on your PC and find out all of the uh, outdated driver from your PC, guys. If it is the uh, any kind of the chipset driver, the system device driver, any kind of this will guys show you all these here. So guys, you can check it out here. This is uh, showing all of this driver. Just you need to guys click here on this update button. And guys, it will ask you for uh, this. So guys, click just uh, don't remind me again and click OK. So guys, it will uh, create a restore point and then it will uh, automatically uh, start the updating and the installation of your drivers on your PC. So guys, once all of the installation is complete, so guys, now it will ask you for uh, like uh, purchasing this software for the more update. But guys, the free version is enough for us. So guys, just simply close out it and here you can check it out here. It is guys. Uh, almost install all of the driver and guys if any other driver you want to install so you can just simply uh, check out the name here the microsoft visual c plus plus the microsoft uh, server right and the game driver and then and that kind of stuff you can just simply uh, open your browser and search the name of the driver and just simply install it uh, for free but guys still it is enough to installing the driver which the software uh, gives you the free so guys after doing all of the settings you can check it out here this will uh, ask you for restarting your pc right now to take this effect but guys uh, now we are going to do some other settings and you can also check it out here guys here is the boost option uh, you can also use it uh, use the software as a game booster or the uh, system optimizer guys this is really good so guys just after doing all of the settings just simply guys uh, close out the software or just minimize it now go open uh, the boost pack again and guys here is the uh, power up cpu uh, the third folder guys here is the software which is the mz uh, cpu accelerator so guys you need to just simply double click here click yes and guys install the software on your pc also guys just simply click next next and guys here we're done just simply guys click finish
And guys, here is the uh, interface of our MZ CPU accelerator software. Guys, we are going to use this software. You can check it out here. The currently optimization is the acceleration is disabled. So guys, we need to enable the acceleration. So how can uh, we do it, guys? Just simply click here on this button, onto the activate button, and this will, guys, uh, optimize your all the PC and uh, activate your MZ CPU accelerator. So guys, you can check it out here. There it is now activated. So guys, you need to just simply, guys, now minimize the software. This will keep running in your background. And if you want to close it, so guys, uh, close it. This will uh, still running in your background always when you turn on your PC. And guys, this is the safe and the best for you. So guys, after doing all of these settings, now go back into the main directory of the boost pack. And here is our fourth step, which is the disable Windows useless things. Guys, before installing all of these files on your PC, I recommend you to guys create a restore point because this will disable some uh, kind of the uh, services or some kind of software or the programs which you are using on your windows but guys this will disable it so guys before starting this step I recommend you to guys create a restore point so guys for creating the restore point you need to just simply uh, click here on this window search and just type here restore and here is the option for a creator restore point now go into the configurations button turn on this from protection set it on to the 7% hit apply then click ok then go for the create button and name it anything like i'm just typing here windows 10 then click on to the uh, create button and this will create a restore point on your pc so guys once the restore point was created on your pc so guys simply click close hit ok then now it's time to installing all of these guys uh, commands or the disabling the all the unused things from our windows 10 and guys this will really help you to guys boosting your performance of your pc so i just simply right click here and make sure to run this as administrator all then click yes then click yes again and keep clicking yes 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 and yes so guys just after doing all of these things now guys you can check it out here this will uh, install all of these files in your background and now we are done guys now just simply go back into the uh, main directory of your boost pack and here is guys our last file which is the command uh, power plan so guys just simply open this notepad copy this file from here go for this window search and just type here cmd and also guys make sure to run this as administrator click yes paste here this command press enter and this will guys create our ultimate performance power plan on your pc now guys close out the cmd and also close out this pack now now it's time to selecting the best power plan on your pc for getting the better performance of your cpu and the gpu so guys now go into windows search again and type here power and sleep settings then go into the additional uh, power settings and guys here is our high performance power plan which we have created here or the ultimate power plan which we just created on our uh, pc by using the cmd so guys click here onto the uh, ultimate performance guys this is the best power plan for you if you are uh, on the laptop and you are getting uh, this issue so guys uh, if you also on the pc so guys still it is the best for you so guys after uh, selecting our it now just simply close out this window and now it's time to guys doing some settings for the uh, system devices or the high precision event timer now guys go into the properties of your this pc then guys go ahead for the device manager then scroll down and guys here is the option for the uh, system devices click on this drop down menu and find out the high precision event timer from this list so guys here is the high precision event timer right click here disable it click yes and guys here we done now just simply guys close out it again and now guys it's time to now restarting your pc because this is the most important step because uh, you have installed the driver on your pc do some cmd command stuff and also use uh, software which helps you guys doing this so guys now it's time to guys restarting your pc and then i will come back and show you some uh, other stuff so guys here after restarting your pc now here is the uh, next phase of the optimizations now this is for your gaming stuff so guys like i play fortnite on my pc and i get the low gpu and the high cpu usage so guys for fixing the problem in our uh, fortnite i need to guys go for the location where i have installed my uh, fortnite so guys i installed it in my c drive program file then epic game folder fortnite fortnite games binary win64 and here is the my directory of my uh, fortnite where is the launcher file of my fortnite and some uh, exe file so what you need to do guys is simply go into the properties of your these files go for the compatibility sections then check mark on the disable full screen optimizations then go for the change high dpi and also check mark here on the over wide high dpi scaling behavior uh, the scaling performance by so guys select the application from this drop down then click ok hit apply then click ok and do the same guys settings 
for your all these guys uh four xb files or if you are the valorant player so guys if you want to optimize your valorant so guys do the same settings with your uh, launcher of your valorant if you play gd5 so guys do the same settings uh, with the gta 5 uh, launcher files guys you play any kind of guys uh game and you're getting this issue so guys do the same settings this is guys a simple thing no any kind of the rocket science so guys after doing all the settings now here is our last step which will guys increase the performance of our gp for the gaming so guys you need to go into the uh, display settings from here go into the graphic settings and add here the all your games which you have on your pc like i already had all of the xd files here into this list so guys like for example now i want to add here my gd5 so i will go here into this browse sections then go for the location where i have installed my gd5 here is my gd5 and here is the gd5 launcher you simply uh, click onto this uh, xd file then click add then go into the option and set it onto the high performance of your gpu whichever you have now your gpu will give you the best performance for this game when you launch this game now close out it and guys now after doing all the settings now guys you can uh, launch your fortnite or any other game which you wanna play the gd5 the warzone the csgo the valor and any guys game not just simply launch out it and i also recommend you to guys uh before running your fortnite or any kind of game on your pc guys open the device uh driver booster software and guys one time go into the boost sections and click on this uh, super boost and this will guys make your pc a lot better for the gaming so guys that's it for this video i hope so guys uh, this video helped you a lot to guys fixing out your this issue and you will also guys satisfy my uh, this video so guys make sure to drop a like on this video tell me in the comment section uh, what the results you get after doing the settings so guys till at the next video allah hafiz and bye bye